Well, who saw this one coming tonight on the Pac-12 Network in Pullman? Greg Talbot with the rest of our crew to put a bow on this one. These two teams right there in the middle of that log jam in the Pac-12 Network standings, but Arizona State comes away with a 2-0 win, and the Arizona State freshman keeper Paulina Nellis with the night of her life. She was the MVP tonight. Let's see how it happened. We had no score in the first half of this one despite two big attempts. Mackenzie Frimpong Ellerson was a monster, even as a midfielder taking shots tonight for the Cougs. What a save by Paulina Nellis to keep it nothing, nothing with the hard right knockaway. And then on the other side, the all time goal leader for ASU, Nicole Douglas, off the bar. And Nadia Cooper caught a little bit off guard. So again, nothing, nothing at halftime. But that happens all the time here at Lower Soccer Field. In the second half, five minutes in, Arizona State catches Nadia Cooper off guard. Lucy Johnson back in the fold after an injury. She finds the hometown hero, Olivia Wen. She's from Tempe. Made it 1-0 Devils. Not the end of the world for Wazoo. It's happened before. They had a big run and a flurry of attempted goals in the second half. That was Margie DeTrezio, though called back for offsides. So people not happy about that one in Pullman, obviously. A few minutes later, Grayson Lynch into Frimpong Ellerson off the sidebar. Still, Arizona State in front, and that one ended up being the winner. 73rd minute, Hannah Leitner, her first of the season. What a time for it. Made it 2-0 Arizona State, and the Cougs ran out of energy after that. Taking a look at the stats, 32-8 shots for Washington State. But in terms of the ones on goal, only seven for the Cougs, five for the Sun Devils, and frankly, theirs were the better ones. They had the cleaner looks. 